So here I am at the Hanover Fair, which is the leading industrial fair showcasing the state of the art in industrial technologies. And I want to take advantage of being here to talk to you about the digital twin. As we all know, the digital twin is at the heart of industry's transformation to advanced manufacturing to Industry 4.0. And the digital twin is operationalized by a technology called the Asset Administration Shell. The Asset Administration Shell is the standard that is being developed by the industry as we speak in order to ensure the seamless data flow across all parts of the industrial value chain. And I want to show you just one example of how the digital twin and the Asset Administration Shell is put to use. So here we have an energy monitoring device, three different producers, more or less the same device, uh, used as part of every single production line across the world to track energy performance. Now, what does the Asset Administration Shell allow us to do? Whichever one of those devices is used, is plugged in to the Asset Administration Shell and allows us in a completely standardized way to track all the data related to this device. So starting with the digital nameplate, mirroring to some extent the information that would be normally on the nameplate on the product itself, but of course a lot more complete simply by doing it digitally, including all the technical specification of that particular product. Now much more interesting for us of course is some of the parameters of the device that can also be shown here. So let's take the process parameters uh, around the energy flow. We can track in real time the different aspects of the energy management that we are interested in. Now think about the potential here. At the click of a button, Volkswagen can see in one standardized format the energy information related to all of those devices across their production sites in the world can understand where the efficiency gains are to be, can understand which of those devices are performing better and which are not, and adapt its own operations accordingly. And this is also why this is so relevant for the discussion that we are having today on the Digital Product Passport. The Digital Product Passport tries to achieve the exact same thing. It tries to understand how data across the different parts of the value chain in relation to the sustainability of a product can be captured and can be shared. That is exactly what the Asset Administration Shell is about. And just as the energy data can be captured and shared, this could be carbon footprint data or any other data related to materials and sustainability impacts and so on. The technology is already here. We have to build on that. 